Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How much does it cost to register a motor vehicle? Registering a motor vehicle involves several steps and various fees, which can differ significantly depending on the state and type of vehicle. Here are some key points to consider. Vehicle type. The cost to register a motor vehicle varies based on the type of vehicle. For example, in Virginia, the registration fee for a passenger vehicle can range from $35.75 to $44.75, depending on the gross weight of the vehicle. State fees. Each state has its own set of fees for vehicle registration. In Vermont, the registration fee for an auto, motorcycle, or truck can be $91 for one year or $167 for two years, with additional fees for clean air and other services. Weight and HP. Some states, like Missouri, base their registration fees on the vehicle's taxable horsepower or gross weight. For Missouri, the fee for passenger vehicles starts at $18.25 for under 12 HP or electric vehicles and increases based on horsepower. Additional fees. There are often additional fees for items such as license plates, titles, and administrative costs. In Connecticut, for instance, a regular two-year registration for a passenger car includes a $24 registration fee, a $5 plate fee, and other administrative fees. Special cases. Certain types of vehicles, such as electric vehicles, low-speed vehicles, and antique vehicles may have different registration fees. In Virginia, for example, the registration fee for an electric vehicle is $128.14. Local fees. Some states also have local fees that may apply based on where the vehicle is garaged. In California, fees can vary by city and county, including county fees and special license plate fees. Renewal and late fees. Renewal fees and late fees can also apply. In Virginia, there's a $10 late fee for vehicle registration, and renewal fees can vary based on the vehicle type. Online transactions. Many states offer online options for vehicle registration and renewals, which can sometimes reduce the cost. For instance, in Virginia, some online transactions may have lower or no fees for certain documents. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.